Pepperdine hosting Seattle University on Friday night before the game. Dr. Steve Potts with a prayer for the families affected by the tragedy that happened in Connecticut earlier in the day. Our hearts and our prayers certainly go out in that situation. Onto the game, ESU Starry in the first half. The drive, grabbing some contact, flipping it up and in for the and one. The Waves defense leading to some offense. Here a steal, Shustari leading the break. Kelsey Brockway, a little Euro step there, getting through the lane, laying it up and in. Waves off to a hot start, 9-2, to two, but Seattle University came to play in the first half. They would lead much of the first half here, grabbing a steal and going the other way, 4-2. Waves trying to cut into that lead near the end of the first half. Steal by Ishu Stari up ahead to Bria Richardson, who finishes on the other side. Waves would be down 36-33 at the break. Second half now, Shea Kunu williams the drive, kick out to Amanda Lovely, who knocks down the jumper. And then Jade McNorn, what a game for Jade. Career high, 13 points. Career high, 11 rebounds is a nice little move down low for her. And then McNorton picking up the assist, kicks it out to Kelsey Brockway, who had a career high, 8 points for the ways. Bria Richardson, steal going coast to coast, laying it up and in as a strong second half for Pepperdine, outscoring Seattle 37-28 in the second half. Jade McNorton here finishing the game off with the foul and the put away. Waves win 70-64. And coming off of 12 days rest, how much did that rest help you guys? Um, it helped us so much. We were really just sick of playing each other. So I think that whoever our opponent was going to just have to deal with us, like we really had our agenda set and came out well. The first career double-double, 13 points, 11 rebounds. What was working for you? You were all over the court, free throw line, offensive rebounds, all, all of it. Yeah, I was very surprised I had a double-double. I don't really know where it came from, but uh, hopefully it's the first of many. 